Hi, hello. Uh, I was given a review code for Super Onion Boy Plus, and I wanted to check it out. Um, I will tell you right now, I think the game is fun. It's a 7 out of 10. Um, I think you should check it out. Now, if you want to know why I feel that way, go ahead and watch the rest of this. But if you just wanted to know really quick, there it is. It's a 7 out of 10. It's a fun game, and I think you should check it out. But, okay, now let's get into it. What worked for the game? The game is inherently fun to play. And what I mean by that is it just works. Platformers are a simple genre, but I think one that can sort of just try to rely on itself. And what I mean by that is sometimes you play a platformer and it just doesn't click any boxes in the sense of being original. I think Super Onion Boy Plus is fun and it is simple in a good way, um, which sort of leads me into the graphics. The graphics are bright, colorful, and I think overall really gives a good aesthetic to the game. Um, the main character is adorable. Uh, the different like worlds there are, they all stand out even if it's a bit uh, basic, again, simple. Um, you know, you have your desert world, you have your forest world, and overall, I just think that it works. That all being said, another plus would be the fact that the game is short, and what I mean by that is I don't know if it's just me nowadays, and that's totally fine if it is. I feel like most games that I play require a huge investment for me to feel satisfied with the game. Um, you know, in a lot of these open world RPGs, it takes 5-10 hours to even like get into the game. Whereas with Super Onion Boy Plus, the whole game can be done in about an hour. It took me about 75 minutes to get through it, and admittedly, I'm pretty good at platformers, so maybe it would take you a little bit longer, but there are only 15 levels in the game. And while for some that may be a negative, for me personally right now, I find that to be a positive. Now, the game is only $4, so, you know, it, you are paying a small price for a small game. But one, like I said, is just inherently fun. Now, the game isn't perfect. Um, I think sometimes the controls will sort of escape you like there was once or twice where I sort of phased through a block or got hit by an enemy I probably shouldn't have but it's not common um, this is an issue that happened very rarely in my playthrough and the good news is is that the game is just sort of forgiving for the most part anyways you get one ups all the time in the game just through playing it what didn't work Though, um, for me, I thought that even though the game, I was just talking about how it's simple and how it is easy, there is a difficulty spike uh, in the later half of the game. So like level 12 and on or so, um, it just spikes up out of nowhere. Um, and maybe it was just because it was the first time while playing Super Onion Boy Plus that I felt challenged while playing it. It, to me, it just sort of came out of nowhere. Um, and not to say that that might be inherently bad. I just feel like it, maybe it could have ramped up a little bit more. Um, I also wasn't a huge fan of the music. I love chiptunes, and I tend to adore old-school soundtracks and OSTs. But for whatever reason, this one just didn't stick out to me. Um, it is it is the same track through each individual world, and I don't think it's they're like inherently bad. It just didn't stick out to me in any sort of way. Um, all of this to say, Super Onion Boy Plus is a fun game. I think that if you are just looking for like a bite-sized adventure title, I think you'll enjoy yourself for four bucks. Like you can do so much worse. But yeah. This has been Andrew with Ubercrit. Thanks for checking out this this new style of review. If you if you're watching this, let me know what you think. This is a little bit more unscripted, and I just kind of wanted to give you my thoughts on everything uh, rather than write everything out. I feel like 
this might be sort of the way that I do reviews here in the future. Um, but let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching.